back to the YouTube channel on Pro Enzo Vids, and this is my thoughts on the debut of Young Hooker for the Eels. Um, Brendan Hand, any sides gone point win over the um, Penrith Panthers, winning 17 points to 16. Now, what a game, first of all. That was a fantastic game. It was a fantastic contest. Um, both sides played fantastic, I, I must admit. Um, I, re I really thought Penrith were going to steal it at the end, but, um, you know, Penrith um, just couldn't hang on and. Parramatta managed to pull through for their home fans at Combank. So, oh, look, it was a good game. I, I enjoyed it, actually. It was a good one. And um, I think we expected a, a very interesting game between both the grand followers and the rematch. So, yeah, it was good. It was a good game. But, um, yeah, no, this is my thoughts on the day of Brendan Hands. And, yeah, uh, it's actually interesting, his story about getting to, to the NRL. Obviously, um, he's 24 years old. So, he's not, like, young, young, but still, like, a young age, I guess. But, um yeah, but to make your debut at that age, it's like not, yeah, I think, I guess it's it's considered a bit old, but uh, look, he made his debut, that's the main thing, and um, you know, he, I thought he did a good job uh, for the time he was playing for the Eels, I thought he uh, actually did a, uh, a solid job out there, made some good tackles, made some good, good runs, and bring actually some spark off the bench, you know, I think when Josh Hogson came off, um, you could see Brendan Hands had that extra sort of speed and a bit more of a bit more of a skill skill set than what Hogson has. No offense, but you know that's obviously the difference between the two hookers. And uh, no, he did well. Uh, I think Brendan Hands um, went pretty well on debut. He seemed to have changed. He seemed to change the way Parramatta attacked towards the end. And, and um, yeah, he's got he's got some good speed about him. So I think uh, that's the main thing that he got through the game well. And uh, you know, uh, made his debut in the end. I mean, I think it's a great, a great moment for anyone that wins on their debut. But it's even better when you score a try on debut. And that try you scored on debut was mad. Like, that was a crazy great try. Like, Matt Dury is, has been a good signing for the Eels so far. He got that offload away out the back there. And then back inside was um, Brendan Hand supporting in support. I think it was um, Will Pinacini that was away there um, when um, Dury offloaded. I can't remember exactly, but... Yeah, the ball was passed back inside to Brendan Hands in support, and he scored a try. So it was, you know, that was good. It was a good moment for Brendan Hands just to come on with his, like, what, second or third touch, even maybe first. I don't know. But, yeah, he only just came on when he scored his first try. So that was um, good. That was good. And I think it's pretty common with a debutant for some reason to um, come on from the bench and score just straight away. It's, it's always a common trend in that. But, um, no, good on Brendan Hands for scoring um, a try and getting a win on debut. I think that's a... Uh, a positive way to start your in our real career. So um, now well done team, and it was a good game. So I enjoy, enjoyed it as a fan, as a neutral fan of that game tonight. It was good, and um, yeah, uh, congratulations to Brendan Hands. But anyways, everyone, thank you for watching my uh, quick thoughts on the day of Brendan Hands. Uh, make sure you do like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and comment your thoughts on the game and Brendan Hands' debut. So see you in the next one.